Good morning, friends. Welcome to another vlog here on Apples and Tiaras. Um, it is currently 625 and I am getting ready to leave the house. Um, I woke up at like 545 today is when I got out of bed anyway. Um, my alarm's usually set for 515 and then I snooze for a while. Um, towards the middle slash end slash middle end of the year, I start to, um, not get up as early. So it kind of does affect like when I get to school. I haven't been eating breakfast these last couple of weeks. So like the last six or seven weeks, I think it's been since I've really eaten breakfast consistently. Um, I'm just eating at like 11 o'clock in the afternoon is when I eat my first meal. Um, I'll drink my skinny tabs first thing in the morning to help with cravings and help me fast. And then I drink water and then I will also drink a coffee. So I think this is like called dirty fasting. Again, like I said last week, I don't need to know the rules. I'm kind of beating to the, my own drum right now. But anyways, I'm going to leave at 624. I'll probably get to work around 715 ish, depending on traffic. And then I'll update you guys when I get there. Like in movies. Ah, there's another cat! You guys, put your cats away. Okay guys, so I just walked in the door and I have a whole lot of Valentine's Day still going on in here. Today's um, Tuesday the 19th of February, so yesterday was President's Day. Um, I still have a crock pot that has, that was hot chocolate. I've got some dishes I need to do. I have not cleaned up my teacher area. <laughs> I've got a graphing project still up on the board. I have our Valentine's Day schedule up still. My desk is a wreck, but that's okay, guys. This is just the teaching world. Um, Friday was Valentine's Day, and I did not want to stay late to clean up, so I'm going to do that this morning. It's 7.20. Um, i just been, like, chatting with Mandy for a little bit this morning. Um, we have our STARS test today, which is our district test for assessment of growth, um, and today is the writing test. So, um, the whole day is probably going to, it's probably going to take the whole day. Um, so I am going to spend my morning cleaning. Then while the kids are at specials first thing this morning, I'm going to prep everything for the test. So put up my slide, um, get everything ready to go. The kids are in, um, different formations than they were the last time you guys saw my classroom. I know I change it up all the time, but I'm trying to find what's best for the kids. So I now have, um, six groups, uh, six and a half. I call, I call these two, two and a half. Um, so this is a group I've got, let's see, a bunch of tables. I actually have one, two, three, four long tables in the back, kind of like fanning out. And then I have these two tables in the front projector. And then I have a desk on each end. So this is group one, group two, two and a half, three, four, five, and then this side is six. So this has actually worked out pretty good. Um, I am going to be moving a few of them just for testing purposes. Like these desks, I'll probably face 
forward a different way and then have one kid sit on this side and one kid on this side for testing. Same thing for this side. And then um, for the other ones, I'll probably put a kid on each end of the table and then one on each side so that they're not like directly next to each other and they'll have a little bit more space. So anyway, I'm gonna start cleaning. I don't have anything to prep today because this is a writing test. It's probably gonna take the most of the day. Um, tomorrow we're doing the math test. And then guys, I have an observation on Thursday. My lesson is prepared, ready, copied for, everything is ready to go, but I do my pre-observation tomorrow. So I'll just go and do that. Um, I didn't stop for coffee today. I just grabbed one of these things from Sprouts last week, these cold brews. So I'm just gonna drink that this morning while I clean. I'm gonna pump some music and just get this room clean. I have about 40 minutes until the kids get here. Um, so I'm just gonna go and get it done. All right, guys. So some time has passed. <laughs> we started um, our STARS writing test since I last talked to you. And it has become very frustrating because the test is set up in a way that isn't testing students on a skill that they should be learning in third grade, but something that's completely different. So that's a little frustrating. Hold on, I'm gonna unlock my door. Okay, so for lunch today, I'm having one of my core maize meals. This is the mac and cheese with carnitas. Super delicious. Okay, so as I was saying, the test that my students are taking today is not a true <laughs> assessment of what I've taught or what they should have been taught. Um, it's completely not standards based, which is very frustrating as a teacher because we have our standards, we know what to teach them, and then they get tested on something completely off the rocker. And it's just very hard because I feel bad for my kiddos who sit there and stare at it and they don't know what to do because I've never taught them how to do that. And they aren't supposed to be taught how to do that in third grade. So I'm feeling a lot of emotions. My, my aide was like, Charlotte, take a breath. You're gonna be okay. So we're gonna, we're gonna um, join as a team and discuss what's going on in our plan of action. It's just a district assessment, so it's not like the end of the world. It's not easy merit, but it's still very frustrating. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so we're gonna eat lunch, and <laughs> it'll be an interesting conversation. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It is Wednesday morning. Um, I attempted in every way, shape, and form yesterday to vlog a day in the life. So um, I think we're going to just make this a week in the life video because yesterday got crazy. Um, so it's Wednesday morning. I'm grabbing a coffee. Good morning. What can I get for you today? Hi, can I please get a medium iced coffee with vanilla and cream? A medium iced coffee, vanilla and cream, you bet. What else can I get for you? That's all. Alrighty. Your total is two eighty one. Thank you. Thank you. I went to Dunkin' this morning. Starbucks just is too expensive for me. So went to Dunkin'. Okay, so anyway, um yesterday the end of the day got really busy. Um, my kids ended up taking all the way until the bell, two of them, to finish their writing. And I still don't think they finished. I think that they rushed because they knew that the end of the day was coming. Um, and so it just really has me reflecting on what I need to do um, before AZ Merit because that is in April. I think it's the first week in April we take AZ Merit writing. And... Um, even though I know that this assessment didn't actually mirror AZ Merit, it was a lot more, it, it didn't seem like it was a third grade standard that they were being assessed on. We're not gonna go into that, um, but I know AZ Merit will be different, but still it gives me a good idea on what I need to do for them. Um, today is my pre-observation. So during my prep time, I will be meeting with my Dean of Students. She's training to be a principal. Um, and so she's doing my observation, which is really exciting. 
um, especially for her. I, I know that like if I was going to be a principal, I would be ecstatic at the chance to be able to observe and evaluate somebody. So that's really exciting. Um, so she's going to be coming in tomorrow to do an observation. And guys, I really want to record my lesson for you. Um, we have this thing called a swivel and I think I'm going to record myself and then share it with all of you guys. Since my students have consent to be shared on social media, I think it would be really, um, interesting to show myself actually teaching an entire lesson. So it will be kind of a longer video, it'll probably be like an hour, 45 minutes to an hour, but it'd be a whole video of me teaching. Hold on. Okay, friends, so I am now here in the classroom and I am sitting down to fill out my pre-observation protocol form. Um, I do have my post or my pre-conference today. And so I just have like all my documents for my lesson that I'm gonna use. I have to take that up. I need to print my lesson plan and then I need to fill in this pre-observation protocol. But I wanted to show you guys this really super cute iced coffee koozie. I know this isn't like a new thing. It was new to me. Um, they're made by the Love Mish Collection, but it's like this cute little koozie for your iced coffee, and um, they're made for like different size coffees. But I ordered that what last week, ish, two weeks ago, um, and it was like thirty dollars. Can you believe this? Thirty dollars. Uh, Mandy said she would make one. Um, but I can't do that because I'm not talented like that. So I just ordered one, but I'm super pumped about it. Happy Thursday, guys. It's um, 7.05 and I'm like five minutes away from school. Today is observation day. I already drank my skinny tabs. You guys, in my next video, I'm gonna be sharing a giveaway link for these. <gasps> for skinny tabs. Um, they contacted me about doing a um, giveaway. Um, so that's really exciting. I'm at stoplight. I also got a bagel. And I'm just, at this point, it is what it is. Um, I'm planning on having the swivel, which is like this really cool camera that sets up in the corner of your room. And you wear this little like tracking device. And then as you walk around the room, it like records you. So I'm going to try to have that for my observation. I need to ask, um, well, I already asked our Title I specialist if I could use it and she said she was gonna try to make sure it was charged for today so that I can use it. So hopefully I can get that situated in the morning because my observation's right after my prep period. And um, so I'm only gonna have like 30 minutes to prepare since I do have duty this morning as well. But I've been prepped for this lesson for like a week and a half now because we had testing yesterday, we had testing the day before, we had Valentine's Day the, day the Friday before that. So I really have had plenty of time to prepare for this lesson. So everything is ready. I just, you know, obviously have some like fine touches I need to do. 